in the name of Jesus Christ. So your father has siblings. Yes, yes. Okay. And that has resulted you to having a female cousin. Yes, I was thinking about her. Okay. So you were thinking about her? Yes, I've been thinking about her. I tried to connect her, but we lost the connection uh, because the relationship was not good. Okay, and this female cousin was from your father's sibling side? Yes. Okay. So me as your brother, you know, Jesus Christ said, the greatest among us shall be your servants. And I can mm -hmm. see that you assume the role of a servant today to help others. Mm -hmm. So that is very good. So you'll be great in the kingdom of heaven. And because you've stooped down to serve others, God, Jesus, will wash your feet today. Amen. One truth about this is that the female cousin will be found by the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. You yourself, you are carrying a you are carrying some money. This the issue of investment. You have to be cautious about it. Keep things in a low profile. Remember the house that you have bought? Every single mistake that we do, it will lead on to the next one. God sees your child. By you coming here today, the Holy Spirit is standing there. He wants to mend the relationship between you, your father, and also because of the marriage that your father did with your mom. Amen. Amen. Okay. So because you have stood here firm for God, God will back and solve the things. Hallelujah. <laughs> because the two of them, there are plenty of disagreements to start on. Thank you, Prophet John. That's 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 one hundred percent accurate. <laughs> Tell your brother that God sees him. Yes, man of God, I've got two brothers, an elder brother and a younger brother. So if you did not tell me the elder or the younger, I will still tell you the elder one. <laughs>